Something strange is happening on AdSense this year. People are uploading their ID cards and everything is correct. Like the name matches, the photo is clear, every single thing is intact, but AdSense still rejects them. And the worst part of it is that if you started your AdSense setup like few months ago, it can be last month, two months or three months ago, and you didn't finish it. This recent new update, that is this recent new verification update, might actually be blocking your verification without you even knowing it at all. So in today's video, I am going to be breaking down to you all the three latest AdSense setup verification updates in 2025 that you have to pay attention to so that the minute you get monetized, you know what to expect and what to do exactly. So with that what being said, let's get straight into the video. As we all know, YouTube recently updated the verification process. That is, if you get monetized, once you meet the, um, the $10 threshold, you'll be requested to send a PIN, that is apply for a PIN. That is, you have to verify your identity first before you go ahead to apply for the PIN. And the usual process is for you to apply and your PIN is going to be sent to you like three weeks after, which might even take up to a month plus. Depend on your postal service and a lot of other things. But of recent, YouTube has now updated a recent one, which is instead of waiting for three weeks, instead of applying and all this stress, the, the recent updates that they bring out is you can actually do all these things within 10 minutes online yeah that is you can literally verify your identity and you know for it to verify your identity you need your ID card either your ID card your driver license or your passport that is either of these three you can be able to make use of one and verify your identity and with this new way of verifying your identity that youtube has recently updated for us adsense itself have upgraded their identity verification system that means you have to be extra careful and also another thing is this system is extremely sensitive that is if you make a single mistake while verifying your identity it can affect you for long because most of us, the name we use on our payment ID, that is when setting up our access, is not the same name that we use. If you make a little mistake with the spelling of your name, you can, that is, they can actually reject you immediately. Now, let's say, um, for example, my name is um, Chuku Joy Chamaka. And while setting my AdSense, I made use of Joy Chamaka Princess. Or maybe I like change it to Chamaka Chuku Joy. Why setting my AdSense? Now, when you want to verify your identity, you have to make sure that your ID name matches with that particular name you use when setting up your AdSense. If there is a little mistake, you will get rejected immediately. That is, you're going to be having issue when scanning your ID card or your passport or whatsoever you want to be using to verify it. That is why you have to make sure that every single thing is intact. Check it if they are correct before proceeding with this particular verification. If not, you're going to be having issue. Now, the second thing is name correction delay is causing too many rejection. So now let's say, um, for instance, the name on your AdSense is quite different from the name on your id that you want to use to verify your identity and you went ahead to proceed with this particular procedure because you know this um online own we request both your facial verification and every single thing let's assume that you went ahead to fix this particular thing and maybe along the line it detects that the name on your adsense is, is quite different or slightly different from the name on your ID card. Now, if you go ahead to like maybe change it because yes, obviously you can change it. You can correct that error immediately. But the thing now is if you go ahead to correct that particular error, it might still give you tough time. That is what you simply need to do is to make sure you give it like two to three working days before you come back to continue your, your verification. If not, you're going to keep getting rejected. And that is what a lot of YouTubers are facing currently. So one thing you need to know is that Google will not update that error immediately. Even if from your portal it shows that your name has been corrected or even if you get the email, you have to at least give it like three to four days in order for you to like process where 
before you go ahead to continue with your verification. This is what a lot of us out there are facing and we are currently confused. So maybe if you are in this particular phase, just know that this could be what is causing it. So obviously, the only solution now is after changing your name, you have no choice. You just have to wait for like 72 hours or even more in order for it to reflect on your AdSense, okay? A lot of people that started their AdSense setup since two months ago, that is either January, February, or even March, and did not complete their verification process. That is, they didn't complete every single thing. Now, in May, when they go ahead to try it all over again, they are going to be facing a lot of issues. Why is because AdSense system was upgraded in April 2025. That is, I think towards the, I, th I think towards the ending of April 2025. And the second reason is some old setups are not compatible with the new system. Yes, because the, the verification, every single thing from the beginning might not be the same. The way you sign up for your monetization back in three, four months ago is not the same procedure now. Like every single thing has changed. That is why you are likely to be facing issue. So I believe this particular update can only work out for, let's say, you get monetized maybe this month of May or you get monetized as soon as YouTube updated it. So that is the only way you might not really face issue. But if you monetize before this update come out, then you are going to literally face issue. And it might not even work out for you. And the worst part is that there are actually some countries that this particular update is limited to. Maybe in my next video, I'm going to be listing out all the countries that are not eligible for this online verification self. So maybe if you have been trying this particular um new online verification and it's not working out for you then what you simply need to go out then what you simply need to do is to try the old method that is of you submitting your id and your pin is going to be sent to your postal office it's still the same process you're still going to get it instead of sitting down and waiting because the worst thing that can happen to you is once you're monetized and maybe it gets to this uh, verification aspects and you delay or wait like more than four months you are going to automatically get demonetized i've seen a lot of channels that got demonetized because of delay of setting up their adsense or even verifying their identity so you wouldn't want this to happen to you okay so just like that my student that faced this same issue actually she got monetized i think december last year and she started this whole verification procedure that is setting up the adsense and all earlier that is early this january now we are in the month of may and Finally, she has gotten to the $10 threshold and YouTube told her it's, it's high time to verify your identity. So we tried using this new method. Like while doing it, that was when we discovered that there was an error in her name from the AdSense and also in the name on her national ID card because she used her NIN. So immediately, I decided to correct it. And after correcting it, we didn't even wait we decided to continue with the verification. Even the following day, we decided to try it again, but it didn't still work. It was still saying that her name is not correct. That is, the name on her AdSense is not correct with the name on her identity card. Meanwhile, we have changed it, and Google has even sent her email that the name has been changed. So what we are going to be doing now is to wait for like four more days or five more days and if we wait till then it didn't really work what we just simply need to do instead of waiting and waiting we just go ahead and use the old method why is because this her procedure started since january time and it might actually not go well using this online verification but using the main other old uh, verification it's definitely going to work also, before I forget, another mistake you should try your best to avoid, that is another mistake you should not do in 2025 while setting up for your monetization, AdSense, or anything relating to getting paid on YouTube here. Don't use somebody else's information. Don't say, ah, let me use my father, let me use my sister, let me use my friend, let me use my brother. You are just going to be causing yourself a lot of trouble. 
Why is because this recent online verification, you know, is going to scan your face. It's going to be needing a lot of information about you. So, so using somebody else's name or somebody else to verify your identity is going to be really, really hard. So if you're being caught using a mismatched ID, using under person information to set up your AdSense, um, verify your identity, you might as well be suspended. That is, either you get the money, in fact, you might as well get demonetized immediately. So do not make that mistake. Once you are at the edge of getting monetized, make sure you start getting all your documents ready. If you don't have passport, if you don't have a um, driver license, you can use your NIN. It's very, very easy to get. And also, is that plastic NIN, not the paper slip NIN. So you have to make sure you get all these things ready before you go ahead to start processing your monetization. So if you are in Nigeria or anywhere around the world trying to verify your AdSense this year, you have to be very, very careful. Google is not playing anymore. And any single mistake can as well affect your monetization. This particular thing now has led to few channels demonetized. When I checked um, this um, YouTube portal, I saw a lot of comments. I got demonetized because of a mismatched ID. So you wouldn't want this to be your case. That is why you have to be careful. You have to pay attention to every single new update coming out on YouTube so that you might, so that you will not fall victim. Okay. So I believe you find this video helpful. And if you are out there, maybe you're currently facing this particular thing and you're confused. You can as well drop it in the comment section and I will be in the comments. So I believe this video, you find it helpful as usual. And if you do, you've not yet liked, please do well to like this video, drop me your comments, share this video. And lastly, do not forget to subscribe to my channel. As always, I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.